This is John Torre from Biomechanics LA, and in today's video, we're going to do three different types of kinesiology taping for the shoulder. And the first one is for an AC complex impingement syndrome, or it's an acromioclavicular impingement of the shoulder. And the second one is going to be a scapular stability taping, which I like to do in conjunction with an AC impingement taping, because I think it's just a nice little added uh, touch. And the last one is going to be a rotator cuff uh, discomfort taping. So there'll be three. We're going to do all three in one video. Be sure to clean and disinfect the area before applying the tape. Measure the tape before applying it. Again, I'm going to trim the edges of the tape, and for this particular taping, I'm going to cut a slit down it to give it a fork type pattern. Here, I'm going to anchor the tape just below the needle head of the deltoid and then bring the two forks, or the uh, tails of the fork, one posterior to the shoulder and one anterior to the shoulder with little to no stretch. Since Luke here has an AC impingement syndrome, I'm going to apply the decompression tape immediately on top of his AC joint, and I'm gonna use the Band-Aid method and use 100% stretch. For the rotator cuff taping, I'm going to use the same method as I used before on this deltoid and fork the tape. And when I anchor the tape here, I'm going to anchor it just next to his spine, not immediately on it, and bring it up towards his shoulder and where his discomfort is on his rotator cuff muscles. When I apply the taping for the rotator cuff, I'm going to have Luke sit in a hunched over position. This way the skin along his shoulders is going to be stretched out before I apply the tape. After Luke's tape's all set and put on, I'm going to apply some rock sauce on him just as an added benefit. It's John here again and uh, thanks for tuning in to another biomechanics video. And again, like we said before, if you guys want to see any particular taping for any particular body part, you can just uh, put in the comment section below the video what you'd like to see, and uh, we'll try to get it up for you as soon as we can. Until next time, see ya.